hello everyone you're welcome back to my channel this is Lawrence Ifai. in this video I want to quickly show you how to use the tap to translate function on Google translate to um, effectively communicate Chinese suppliers okay when chatting them on 1688 okay now you are on as you can see I am on the 1688 app right away okay so what you need to do is to just quickly open your google translate okay just open your google translate like i'm opening now you just need to turn on the tab to translate feature okay so what you need to do as you have opened the google translate uh, uh, app you just need to click on where you have these three dots here okay click on it then go to settings you can see settings here click on settings it takes you to this page the next thing you need to do is to here is a tab to translate function click on it okay you just need to turn it on you click on it here is the tab tab to translate feature that icon when it is on it will display this uh, um, icon at the top of the app okay so what you need to do in order to keep this on because in most cases it will turn off automatically so what you need to do is to you see where you have enabled tap on enabled okay tap on enabled as you tap on enabled you can now go back or open up your then open up your 1688 app as you open it up uh, the help for this is to help you to do on page translation on 1688 app when chatting chinese suppliers okay when you come to your app like this you can locate the chat icon down here you look at the chat icon you can see where you have 51 we are just marked okay you just click on it it has turned 54 now okay just click on it to load it okay now um what you now need to do is let's take any of the charts i'm going to take um, these uh, second charts here now okay just click to open it i'll just click on open it now what you need to do um if you have any of the charts you or you're chatting with a chinese supplier you cannot understand uh, chinese you can't understand chinese now so what you need to do is to any of the chinese charts you have or you see you just click and hold it okay click and hold it like you can see the first one here is copy okay is copy the second one is delete is delete the third one is forward okay it's forward so we are making use of the first one you just copy it click on copy then as you click on copy you can see because the tab to translate is on you can see here the icon has shown okay the icon just showed up so any chinese character you copy it will just show up so what you need to do is to tap on it it will do automatic translation for you you can see now okay you can see now it has translated it so this is the um uh this is actually what this does so if you have this function it makes it easy for you to also communicate chinese suppliers faster and easier okay for those that does not have um, that cannot download the high translate or the high dictionary which i did the video in my channel uh, people that are using now uh, iphone they were unable to find it on apple store okay so you can use this feature to also communicate chinese suppliers fast and effectively so as you have this you can also um open up the high translate from this what you need to do is to click on new translation click on new translation if you want to type your own then you can type on english you can say what is for example what is the weights of this product you can see okay so as you can see after typing you can now see where you have copy see where you have copy you also copy it just copy it come back to where you're supposed to type in your test 
where you're supposed to type in your text then you click and hold it then paste the translated character you can now um, send it by clicking on the blue button by the side okay so this is how you effectively use the tab to translate to chat Chinese supplies on 1688 uh, easily and effectively if you got value from this video please don't forget to like and also share this video okay if you're just coming across my channel for the first time don't forget to click on the red subscribe button turn on the notification bell so you always get notified each time i drop any video thank you for watching come back for more videos bye